Is it time for major U.S. exchanges to relist XRP as the you know continued ongoing case against Ripple Labs continues to drag on? More and more people are interested in accumulating XRP. More and more people are feeling bullish about Ripple's chances here, regardless of what happens in their ongoing battle with the SEC in the United States. As we've said many times, it doesn't really matter. I mean, it does, but it doesn't, because Ripple's going to exist with or without the U.S. Brad Garlinghouse has already said that he plans on moving outside the U.S. if things don't go as planned uh, with the Ripple versus SEC lawsuit. But a lawyer has revealed why U.S. exchanges may relist XRP anyway ahead of the potential decision. And in this video, we're going to dive into some of the specifics. Appreciate you guys so much for always coming back here to the channel. You know, XRP has been gaining a lot of steam lately. Huge whales have been accumulating. And uh, U.S. District Court is yet to deliver that much-anticipated summary judgment in the crucial SEC versus Ripple lawsuit. However, as the judge moves closer to concluding the case, XRP relisting on crypto exchanges has become a huge topic of discussion and a major concern among the XRP holders. See, not only does XRP still have a ton of volume right now, but this would 2x, 3x easily, in my opinion, if XRP were easily accessible on major exchanges like Coinbase and what have you. So XRP relisting. Let's dive into this a little bit more in details, guys. So uh, the secondary market sales of XRP have been a majority, uh, majorly rather discussed issue among the experts. The court is yet to address this matter in the XRP lawsuit, however. Now, CoinGate reported that the U.S. SEC on record admitted that LBC token secondary market sales don't constitute a security, which is really bullish for other cryptocurrencies out there like Cardano and XRP. However, the commission's this settlement, uh, the commission's settlement in the library lawsuit would securely would surely be discussed among the Ripple legal team. Now, Jeremy Hogan stated that he's confident Ripple's XRP will be relisted on crypto exchanges once the judge decides whether the token is inherently a security. The SEC's compliant uh, complaint, rather, in the lawsuit claims that XRP itself, of course, is a security. It does not ask anything to discuss uh, the nature of the asset, though. Now, what if the court refuses to admit the issue? Hogan mentioned that there's a very high chance that the court might not take up a particular issue as the commission didn't raise it explicitly. However, both parties can argue over the secondary sales by adding an omission. He highlighted that Ripple and the U.S. SEC can strike an agreement to include this in the hearings. However, the judge could approve the defendant's assertion in the proposed final judgment. Similar scenario, of course, emerged in the library case where the judge agreed to address the issue. Of course, the district court could decide to pick up concerns filed by amicus related to secondary sales. In the latest filings, though, library stated that the commission has failed to provide clarity even after striking a settlement over the issue. What do you guys think? Do you think U.S. exchanges will go ahead and take the proverbial risk in terms of listing or relisting XRP right now ahead of this decision? Or do you think they'll sit and wait? Drop your thoughts down below. Appreciate you guys as always. If you like XRP, you like this content, make sure you guys subscribe as well. We'll be back with more videos like this one. Peace.